Hi guys, today I'm doing another video in my video series of Android Wear tips and tricks, and today I'm going to show you how to submit a Android Wear bug report. Now before you do this, you may want to watch my other video where I teach you how to solve common Android Wear bugs on your own, but if you're fairly certain that it is actually a problem with the Android Wear application that you're using and it's not something that you can fix on your own, then I would suggest definitely submitting a bug report to the app developer. To do that, what you want to do is, in the Android Wear application on your phone, go into Settings, and then click Report Wearable Bug. When you click on the Report Wearable Bug button, what this does is it puts your Android Wear device into a special collection mode. And this is going to collect information about what's happening on your Android Wear device when the bug is occurring. So what you want to do is load up the application that has the bug that happens, and try to make the bug happen again and I leave it on the screen where the bug occurs. So for instance, if I was having a problem with Wear Mini Dialer, I'd bring up the page or I'd bring up the application that was having the problem, make it happen, and just leave it where the bug is showing up, and it will take a screenshot of that for you. And I just leave it here until the screen dims out. And this is gonna take a little while as it's collecting information and as it's taking the screenshot. Your watch is going to run a bit slower while it's collecting all this background information. And for me, this typically takes anywhere from 30 seconds to a minute and a half, so you do have to be a bit patient. Once it's completed capturing all of the data, you're going to get a notification telling you that the bug report has been captured. And then you want to swipe over to the left on your Android Wear device, and then you can click Open. And what this will do is it's going to push a notification back to your phone. And from your phone, you'll then be able to send all of the information that you just collected on your Android Wear device to the app developer to let them know what was happening. So go ahead and click on this notification, and then it's going to prompt you for how you want to send it. I just choose my default email application. And now you can see that we have a text file containing information about our Android Wear device and what was occurring, as well as a screenshot of the problem. And then I suggest that you fill out a brief description in your own words explaining to the developer what's going on. Also note that the to section of the email is blank, so right now we don't have any email address to send this email to. We're going to need to find that. So open up the Play Store, find your specific application that you're having a problem with, and in the description of that application, scroll down, and you should see a developer email um, at the very bottom. And you find that developer email, copy it, paste it into the email, and then send that email to the developer. And then hopefully with that information, the developer will be able to fix the bug. So that's how you submit a bug report to an app developer for Android Wear. But let's say that you found a bug with the entire Android Wear operating system and you wanted to contact Google. Open up the Android Wear app and then click on Help and Feedback. And then at the very bottom of Help and Feedback, you'll see this Contact Us section and click on the Feedback button. And then this will allow you to write Google an email letting them know about a problem that you found with the Android Wear operating system. So give them a description of what the bug is, what's going on. I'd also let them know what device you're using, stuff like that nature. Uh, also, I highly recommend including your system logs. This really is going to be needed information to fix any bug. And then you go ahead and click the little send icon at the top right. And it's going to ask you if you want Google to be able to contact you back. I typically say yes, but that's a personal preference. And then it will submit a bug report to Google. So I hope you guys found this information helpful, and I'd really encourage you, whenever you find a bug, submit a bug report to the app developer. I know it really helps them out. Thanks for watching, guys. If you're interested in learning more about any of the apps you saw in this video, you can find their Google Play download links in the description below. I always love hearing your feedback, so leave me a comment and let me know what you thought. And finally, if you enjoyed this video and you'd like to stay up to date with the latest apps and Android Wear developments, click the subscribe button. I'll see you guys next time.